Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Alyssa, and for today's video, I am so excited because I am going to be talking to you guys about my very first free product that I have ever received via Influencer, and this is what it is. It is the Bare Minerals Mineral Mineralist Hydra Smoothing Lipstick. I am so excited. So when they do send you products, it does come with stipulations. One, you have to disclose that you got it for free, which I have already done, and clearly that is what I'm very excited about because who doesn't love free stuff? Duh. And then you do have to leave reviews on it in certain places. So for example, I got this Bare Minerals lipstick today, and once I'm done doing this video, which was not part of my stipulations, I do have to go leave reviews on Influencer, Sephora, and Ulta, I think. And it doesn't have to be positive reviews. Like if I totally hate this product, I'm going to tell people because you guys know I like to keep it 100% real and if I love it, I'm going to tell you and if I hate it, I'm 100% going to tell you because I don't want you to waste your money on anything. But the reason I decided to film this video was because I wanted you guys to see my honest to God first reaction, my first impression, get my honest thoughts because then when I go leave my reviews, I already know what I'm going to say. I don't even have to pretend because you guys are going to know what I'm thinking. And if I'm being 100% honest with you guys, I haven't even linked my YouTube channel to my influencer account. It only has my Instagram link to it. That's how they judge like your follower count, like how much of a region in which you reach kind of a thing. And for some reason, my YouTube won't link to it, so I don't have to film any videos for them or do anything. Um, they don't even know I have a YouTube channel, yo. So I'm very, very excited for this because, again, like I said, it's my first free product that I've ever received. Um, and I'm so excited to test this out because you guys know I freaking love lipsticks. Now, I am more of a liquid lipstick girl, and this is going to be a bullet lipstick, but lipsticks nonetheless, I hoard them. I love them so much, even though you can literally wear one or two at a time and that's it but regardless so this is the box that it came in it's actually really adorable i really do like the packaging so when i open it up this is what it looks like it's just got the information on the lipstick so it says that this is vegan gluten-free synthetic fragrance free peg free and it's cruelty free we love that it says more clean vegan naturals less unnecessary ingredients on the sides of the box, it says olive oil extract intensifies color for maximum impact in one swipe and the cold pressed fruit oil packed with minerals, vitamins, and omegas to help provide nourishing hydration. The packaging, you guys, is ridiculous. What it must be like to receive PR packages, because this is kind of what it feels like even though it's 100% not, but the packaging is dope. Like, look at the attention to detail you guys it's got all the colors of all the lipsticks in the line around the edge of the box like this is the product that i received the lipstick right here i'm pretty sure it's full size i'm not a hundred percent it is 3.6 grams so i want to say it probably is but this is the packaging it has the color on the top which you guys know how i feel about an orange lipstick. Look at that shade. I have not opened the actual tube, so I don't know, but that is promising. It's just a nice gold packaging. Nothing too fancy, but considering the name is called Minim Mineralist, kind of like Minimalist, I really do like it. So it's just gold. It just says Bare Minerals, and when you pop it open, it says, I'm sure that it's at Bare Minerals on the inside as well. It does have the color sticker name on the bottom. I love when the sticker reflects the color and oh my god you guys look at that shade it has a very clean smell to it I will say my nose is like slightly stopped up did I get it on there no but it smells really clean kind of fruity but just oh really nice I'm gonna give it a swatch really quickly on my hand Wow, that's a really nice like red orange color and that went on really smooth. So it definitely is very hydrating. You can see it has like a light sheen to it. It's definitely not a matte lipstick, which as you guys know are primarily my favorite type of lipsticks. If I'm being honest, like I'm a sucker for a matte lipstick. I just don't like to reapply. But so what I'm going to do is I did have a little bit of my Laneige lip mask on while I did my makeup and I did scrub my lips with my Lush bubblegum lip scrub. I want to let you guys know everything that's on my mouth. I'm going to just kind of wipe this away with my fingers. And we're just going to apply this. I'm not going to use any lip liner or anything like that.
Okay, you guys, first off, holy cow, freaking pigment. This was literally like one swipe color payoff. It was really, really beautiful. Didn't tug at my lips and went on really, really nicely. Now, obviously, this is a hydrating lipstick, so it is very smooth. It does feel really comfortable. I would suggest probably in the future, or if you're looking to try this out, probably use a lip liner. I was able to like, you know, I got a little messy on the bottom as you saw, and I just kind of wiped it away. It was no problem. But I can't tell you that it's going to not maybe bleed or run on your mouth throughout the day because it is not a matte lipstick so it's going to be a little bit more movable if you will so i would definitely suggest the lip liner i just didn't want to wear one in this video so you could see how it applies just by itself but i probably would use one in the future the color is gorgeous it feels very comfortable as you can see i'll get closer it looks really nice i do overline my top lips a bit and i miss this little corner look at that There you go. But you see how easy that went on? So I do overline my top lips a bit just so that my whole mouth looks evenly plump. Um, and I think it looks beautiful. It went on really, really pretty. I really like the color. It smells good. It's not aggravating me. Now I will say, we all know because it's a hydrating lipstick, this is probably not going to last a super long time. You're definitely probably going to need to like take it with you if you're going out for a touch up. I know if you eat or do anything like that, it's probably going to come right off. I mean, let's just... I mean, you guys, like, you know what I'm saying? So don't expect anything like that. But I will say, like, even sharing it out, color looks really pretty. I'm really happy with it. I can't say anything about, you know, if it makes my lips look smoother or flattens out my lip wrinkles. I don't know anything like that. So, yeah, as an overall, just, like, first impressions, really pleased. And the thing that pleases me the most is, again, the color payoff because... This is stunning. Like, it is so vibrant and it is popping so well. And girls, my God, teeth look so white. Okay. Like, look. Yes. So, I really like this a lot. I'm very excited. I will try and keep wearing it and I will either, if I don't pop back on here, and I probably won't, um, I will update you down in the description box if I feel like it does make my lips look smoother or anything like that. Or if I change my mind and I'm like, girl, no, nah, it ain't that good. I really enjoyed this experience. I highly recommend maybe you check out Influencer if you kind of want to receive some stuff every now and then. I don't know how often you get it. Like I said, this is my first box and I've probably been solidly being active on influencer for about a month now so yeah i think it's kind of worth it but you definitely do have to make sure you do follow up and you do leave reviews and you do stuff like that so it, it is more work like it's not just straight up receiving a product for no reason like you do have to do work for it but it can be very worth it especially if you are a makeup junkie like i said i'm so excited that i got a lipstick because i'm just a lipstick hoe you guys so yeah anyways that is going to be it for today's video. I didn't want to be super long. There's really not much to it. Um, I like this lipstick. I definitely think you should go in and check it out. I think it has a lot of really great color selections. Like the nudes and the pinks look really pretty. I don't know so much about the dark ones with it being kind of hydrating. But for it to have like this kind of color payoff is really nice. And it honestly kind of reminds me a little bit of like the Bite Beauty kind of formula that's what they kind of feel like on my mouth if I do say so myself and oh my god is it like the bite beauty lipstick I created because I'm gonna be shook if it's literally like the same color two seconds I've got to know now and I'm gonna know with you guys on camera so I don't know if you guys ever knew this but when I went to New York me and my friend did um create our own lipsticks at the bite beauty lip lab I highly recommend if you've never tried that out, like tried that experience, you do it. I made mine matte. Okay, so it's deeper. It's definitely a slightly deeper color. But you guys, like, look, like I'm telling you, I love these colors. Like, I specifically made this lipstick for me. It reminds me a lot of the Bite Beauty lipstick formula for sure. And so I'm so excited. Okay, you guys, anyways, that is all for today's video on my very first Influencer Box Box featuring the Bare Minerals Mineral List hydro smoothing lipstick i really hope that you enjoyed it let me know what you think down below um, let me know if you've tried influencer let me know if you're thinking about it let me know what you think of this freaking lipstick color and how cute it's gonna look on me in the summer i'm gonna take it with me to key west maybe i'll find a husband in key west thoughts anyways you guys that's gonna be all for today's video i really hope that you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you did
I'm a mess. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Feel free to hit that notification bell if you would like to be notified every time I upload a brand new video. And you can also come follow me on Instagram if you would like, at Alyssa and Pope. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!